Hey there, Scott McGregor again with NG2 Defense. We're going to go over mounting your MaxFlow 3D to your rifle. This is our rifle today. We're just going to use this barrel. Basically what you're going to do is you're going to make sure you have the right thread. Don't force anything. So if it's a 5.56, it's at half by 28. And we just take it easy, screw it on. When you do get it on the barrel, you want to make sure that it seats on the shoulder of the thread cut, just like that. There's no space in there, okay? That should help assure that it is on straight. We'll give it a little torque. Then what you want to do, we recommend, not everybody will have it, but we recommend that you take a gauge or rod of some sort in the correct caliber and make sure that it gauges. Make sure that it does that the gauge doesn't lean up against either side or or uh, just doesn't go through at all. Okay, you don't want to ever use a crush washer. Uh, sometimes there's a flat spacer that works well, but for the, for our purposes, we want it to butt up against the shoulder of the threads, and we want it to gauge. So this looks like it gauges well. So that's what we recommend. Uh, go out and have some fun with your Maxwell 3D.